Welcome everyone to this newest video. 10 top tips on how to spot a fake whiskey. But first let me tell you why I made this video. Whiskey is a booming market since the last couple of years. And because of that, because of this growing market, people want to put their money into whiskey more and more. And that causes the prices to rise. Because of that, there are many new investors that, that think whiskey is a very beneficial way to invest your money. And because of that, there are fakes flooding the market. And this is why I make this video to make you understand how to spot fakes. So the first tip is check the cap of the bottle. Is it damaged or are there loose ends? This shouldn't be there, it should be very solid. Nothing should be sticking out. On the left you see a fake cap, and on the right you see a perfect cap. So tip number two, the tax seal. Some bottles have tax seals on it, and they vary per country. Some have stamps, and some have tax seals. And some older bottles might have lost these tax seals. So if you want to buy a bottle, look online, if your bottle should have one and you can read the back of the bottle to see which country it comes from and then you can see which tax seal it should have on the top right you see a, a very different tax seal than the stamp on the bottom left which is a UK stamp and there's also some uh, stickering on the neck of the bottle and the last picture is the stamp is broken when that happens you shouldn't buy it shake the bottle this causes bubbles to form by the duration of the bottles you can tell if the alcohol percentage that's stated on the bottle matches the whiskey inside. So this is all uh, measurable in a graph. So say for example you have a 40% uh, alcohol percentage whiskey, then if you shake it the bubbles should remove within 5 to 10 seconds. If you have a 45% alcohol bottle they should remove within 15 seconds. 50% they should be gone within 25 seconds. Magnify the problem. Using a magnifying glass or something like that. Check the printing for vertical ridges or pixelation because these indicate a home printed label. And if you see a home printed label, that means someone's printed it and it's a fake. So don't buy it. Tip number five, the purchase location. This is also very important because there are very good purchase locations and also mm, not so good purchase locations. So be sure to buy your bottle at a distillery, a well-known website, friends, local shops, auction houses, and try to avoid second-hand shops, whiskey bays, and unknown sellers, or unknown markets. Tip number six. If it's too good to be true, if there's a special offer or a special price, it usually is too good to be true. So don't buy it, but there are exceptions. Sometimes you can find the right bottle for a very good price. Tip number six, seven, the fill level. Compare the bottle you want to buy with the original bottle online. If the fill is off, then it's probably a refill. Older bottles have more airspace within a bottle because over time this decreases, the alcohol decreases. And you can see on the left here, there's more ullage, and on the right, there's less. Tip number eight, normal damage. New bottles should be in perfect conditions. All the bottles should have some marks on it. The oldest bottle should be damaged. If it's not, it's probably a fake or a very good kept old bottle. Tip number nine, take a look at the bottom. At the bottom, because older bottles uh, most likely uh, have sediment in the bottom. And if it's not there, it's probably a refill of modern whiskey. So check the bottom of the bottle. Tip number 10, touch the edges. Feel around the edges of the label of newer bottles. And if the edges, uh, if, if, if you feel adhesive on the edges, it's probably a fake. Also, check the labels for spelling errors because thieves are usually not that good in grammar. Number 11, ensure your purchase. This is a bonus tip because you should always pay with a credit card or PayPal. If someone refuses that option, it's most likely a scammer that wants to take your money. PayPal and credit card have a guaranteed money refund if you get scammed. However, it does add a small fee over the tr amount transferred. 
And don't forget to don't pay with friends and family option on PayPal because then you're not insured. So make sure you always insure your purchase. 99% of all fake bottles show more than one or two of the earlier mentioned tips at once. Always make sure to check every step of the video before purchasing a bottle of whiskey. And if you want a chance to win a free McAllen whiskey, like, subscribe and keep an eye out for the new videos. So don't forget, like this video if you liked it and please subscribe. Follow the channel because there will be more videos online. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.